Jeepers Creepers, 2001 film. Jeepers Creepers is a 2001 American horror film written and directed by Victor Salva. The movie takes its name from the 1938 song Jeepers Creepers which is featured in the film. Plot The film chronicles a day in the life of two siblings, Trish Gina Phillips and her brother Derry Jenner Justin Long. As they drive through the Florida countryside, a mysterious driver tries to run them off the road. After letting the vehicle pass them, they later see the same truck with a hulking man sliding what looks to be a body wrapped in blood-stained sheets into a large pipe sticking out of the ground next to an old abandoned church. The driver, noticing Derry and Trish have seen him, catches up to them and tries to run them off the road a second time. After barely escaping, Derry insists they go back to the church and investigate. Derry proceeds to crawl inside the pipe with Trish holding on to him but she loses her grip and he slides down the pipe. At the bottom, he finds hundreds of bodies sewn together. Derry finally finds a passage up through the church. He and Trish flee the scene and stop at a gas station where they contact the police. They are phoned by a strange woman who warns them that they are in terrible danger. Confused and frightened, they ignore her warning. Word arrives that the old church had gone up in flames, and all evidence of any bodies has been destroyed. Trish and Derry rush out of the gas station with the police providing a security escort. As they travel, the police are attacked and killed by the mysterious driver of the old truck. The driver loads the policemen's bodies into his truck. Fleeing once again, Trish and Derry stop at a reclusive old woman's house, begging her to call the police. The woman complies, until she notices the driver hiding in her yard. She tries to kill him with her shotgun. But in the process, the driver attacks her and pursues Trish and Derry once again. Trish manages to hit the mysterious driver with their car, and run him over several times. After crushing his body and seemingly killing him, they are horrified to see a giant wing tear through the driver's trench coat and flap frantically in the air. Leaving it on the road, they drive to the local police station to wait for their parents, when they receive another visitor. Giselle Gay Hartman she reveals herself as the woman who phoned Derry and Trish previously at the diner. Giselle tells them the true nature of the mysterious creature, it is an ancient immortal demon known as the The Creeper, which hunts every 23rd spring for 23 days to feast on human body parts which, upon consumption, form part of its own body. She also tells them that it seeks out its victims through fear, and that by smelling the fear from Trish and Derry, it has found something it likes but she does not know what. The wounded creeper attacks the police station and gains entrance to the cells. Giselle, Trish and Derry attempt to escape but find themselves trapped. Giselle warns that one of them will die a horrible death, while the song Jeepers Creepers plays on a phonograph in the background. Derry demands to know which one of them, and she looks to Trish. The three are then discovered by the creeper, and are separated. The creeper heads towards Giselle and sniffs her intently, but lets her go, and heads off to find Trish and Derry. After a lengthy chase, the creeper corners both Trish and Derry in an upstairs room. After sniffing and even tasting them, the creeper throws Trish aside and chooses Derry. Trish tries to reason with it, and offers to give her life for her brothers. The police burst in and take aim, but do not fire. The creeper escapes out the window flying away with Derry. The next day, Trish, contemplating Derry's fate, is picked up by her parents, and Giselle returns home in regret. The final scene shows the Creeper in its new hideout, an abandoned factory, where the audience finally learns what the Creeper wanted, by ripping out the back of Derry's head, it has taken his eyes, leaving Derry's body an eyeless corpse, while Jeepers Creepers is playing in the background. The film ends with Creeper leering at the audience, now with Derry's brown eyes, through Derry's empty eye socket. In a brief post-credits scene, the Creeper's truck is shown hurtling down the road at sunset, blaring its horn. Cost Gina Phillips as Patricia Trish Jenner, Justin Long as Darius Derry Jenner, Jonathan Breck as the Creeper, Patricia Belcher as Giselle Gay Hartman, Eileen Brennan as the Cat Lady. Brandon Smith as Sergeant David Tubbs, 
John Bashar as Officer Robert Gideon, Avis Marie Barnes as Officer Natasha Weston. Reception The film received mixed reviews from critics. It currently holds a 45% Rotten rating on Rotten Tomatoes. Box Office Jeepers Creepers opened in 2,944 theaters and took in a domestic gross of $37,904,175. It later made $21,313,614 internationally, making a total of $59,217,789 worldwide. It broke the record for the highest ever Labor Day opening weekend gross. The record for Labor Day weekend four-day gross is now held by Halloween 2007. Jeepers Creepers now holds the number five spot and the number three spot goes to its successor, Jeepers Creepers 2. Awards Nominated, Academy of Science Fiction, Fantasy and Horror Films, Saturn Award Best Horror Film, Nominated, Academy of Science Fiction, Fantasy and Horror Films. Best Performance by a Younger Actor, Justin Long, Nominated, International Horror Guild, IHG Award Best Movie, Nominated, Catalonian International Film Festival, Best Film, Victor Salva. Sequels Jeepers Creepers 2 In 2003, a sequel was released, Jeepers Creepers 2. Events in the second film take place days after the first film. The Creeper and Derry are the only characters to appear in both films, although they are not the only actors to appear in both films. In the first film, actor Tom Tarantini appears as the minor character Austin McCoy aka Roach who is a car thief and regular in the Poho County Jail. In the second film, he portrays coach Dwayne Barnes. Jeepers Creepers 3 Cathedral MGM has announced a third installment, Jeepers Creepers 3, Cathedral. The film will continue the story of the original film with Trish Gina Phillips who now has a son named Derry, after her late brother Justin Long who was killed by the Creeper in the first film. Trish suffers from a recurring nightmare that her son will suffer the same fate. Trish, who is now rich and powerful sets out with Jack Taggart, Sr., and Jack Taggart, Jr. on a mission to end the Creeper's reign of terror once and for all. The film will also feature the infamous Creeper truck. Jonathan Breck will return as the Creeper. Victor Salva will return as both director and writer. It has recently